Hi, I'm meteorologist TJ Del Santo. We are looking at much quieter weather now after that severe weather rolled on through Saturday afternoon and uh, Saturday evening. A lot of storm damage here. All these storm reports from wind damage. Whether or not it was uh, tornadic, or straight line wind damage yet to be determined. But take a look at that squall line that came on through Saturday uh, afternoon. Uh, likely was uh, some tornadoes in Connecticut, possibly a tornado in Foster situate, perhaps into Johnston. So it's something that uh, the National Weather Service is going to be looking at through the daytime on Sunday. Uh, it's interesting notes here. Beyond that, never has there been a November tornado in Rhode Island, probably not very shocking there. Most of the tornadoes occurred during the warm season. The last Rhode Island tornado was in Portsmouth 2019. That was an EF0 tornado. It just damaged a couple of trees there in Portsmouth. Uh, by the way, the National Weather Service in uh, Norton, they've issued eight tornado warnings during the month of November. Seven of them were on Saturday, and one was just last year interesting notes there hour by hour forecast now we are looking at quieter weather as we head through our sunday here we are eight o'clock sunday morning we're starting off with sunshine we're going to keep the sun into the afternoon but notice the clouds begin to roll in mid and high level clouds we stay dry on sunday and into sunday evening but more rain showers are possible sunday night and into monday so overnight temperatures will be falling back into the uh, upper 30s with clear skies a little breezy uh, and as we look at your sunday we start off with sun clouds tend to uh, roll in as we head through the afternoon temperatures topping out look at that only about 50 degrees or so in the afternoon uh, highs on saturday were in the 60s 50 on sunday so a little bit below average how are we looking for next week we'll have that full seven day forecast for you coming up on 12 news